Hey guys, promised a, a better quality vid, but I've also done a few things since then. I got rid of the uh, multiple Harbor Freight charge controllers and uh, got an Xantrac C60 charge controller. Or it can be a low controller, or it can also be a diversion controller. I'm using it as a charge controller right now. Uh, I've got it equalizing right now. But, it's got a display on it. 70 amps. It, uh, and it's up to 16 volts, which is pretty much where it's holding it for two hours for equalization. Still got the four batteries. Uh, and bought a grid tie inverter, 300 watt grid tie inverter, which I'm not using right now. Uh, I got two of them, but uh, I don't have enough solar power to actually fully drive one of them. I can put, uh, well, with the solar power I got now, which is about seven three quarter amps, I can do probably about amp and a quarter into the grid on one leg. But anyway, this C60 can handle continuous 60 amps and a peak of 85 before it automatically disconnects and it also acts as a blocking diode too at night even though I really don't need that my panels already have the diodes in them but I'm using one of these uh, Harbor Freight charge controllers so I can uh, monitor the voltage pretty easy Also did get one last fourth harbor freight kit. And there they are. So, from here on, I think I'm going to probably get me a, a project box. And uh, probably get uh, two 60 amp breakers so I can uh, have the panels protected. And the batteries. And probably put inside also two disconnects for each. Because usually your breaker really shouldn't be used as a disconnect means. <clears throat> but I was also thinking eventually I'd uh, get uh, some large cables. And get another box and put like a distribution block inside. For all my loads. And have a breaker on it too. To protect that. And I also need to build like a battery box. That I can vent outside. That's why I haven't got any more batteries. Because I have a. Tacos water heater. And. You know if. When I'm equalizing. I shut the thing down. And shut the gas off and all that. I do have some venting on the back porch here that leads up into the attic that has an exhaust fan. <clears throat> so, you know, I have multiple openings in the wall here that leads straight up to the attic. <clears throat> so that, uh, I mean, it wasn't really originally for the purpose of venting. <laughs> Pretty much for, uh, 
working on the house is what I've been doing. Eventually, I plan on ripping it all out and dry rolling. But, uh, anyway, that's it. Catch you guys later.